A Coca-Cola plant employee seriously injured after a chemical spill. Good evening. I'm Latricia Thomas. And I'm Calvin Sneed. It happened at the plant on Amnicola Highway across the street from the Naval Operations Support Center. Hannah Lawrence explains what happened. A Coca-Cola worker carried out of the bottling plant on a stretcher. And we just heard a loud explosion. Justin Fine was working in a building just behind the Coke plant when it happened. And it shook our whole building, so we came out to see what was going on. The rush of emergency responders followed. We thought originally something had fallen on our our building, but then we saw the smoke or whatever it was start going up, so we figured something happened over there at Coke. What you saw in that direction, uh, that was a vapor cloud coming from the chlorine dioxide. Bruce Garner with the Chattanooga Fire Department says workers here at the Coke plant were mixing chemicals in this 250-gallon container. Well, something happened during the operation, and some of that product spewed onto one of the employees, and he was injured. The plant was a evacuated and workers waited outside as hazmat crews sprayed water on the container until the vapor was contained. That was Hannah Lawrence reporting. What was originally thought to be chlorine dioxide was later determined to be a chlorite solution, though firefighters would not say what kind of chlorite solution they were dealing with. We do not know the extent of the employee's injuries, but Bruce Garner did say he was seriously hurt. Tosha will investigate what happened at the Coca-Cola plant. However, because no one died, they say they won't send anyone immediately.